Well, it's official. The Mt. Gox payments have resumed, causing the market to melt down. We've got XRP, XLM, and BTC charts that you need to see. Bro, why BTC? Because the market is following what BTC is doing. But I'm also going to show you where the money is flowing into because it's not just leaving crypto. There's some massive buying going on. You see those blue bars up on the screen? You know what that means? Daddy took a nap. Two and a half hours of sleeping with the doggies. AC blowing, not a care in the world. Let's get into your comments. Rovian says, Payne, I'm loving this drop. Hope XLM goes to five cents and XRP down to 30 cents. I don't care what happens here. I'm playing long term. I just buy more in the meantime. Now, what we've learned is that the dip here is because of Mt. Gox payments. Okay, certain things are bleeding harder than others. Mt. Gox begins repaying Bitcoin to creditors a decade after exchanges collapse. What it means. All right, I want you to think of that statement. So they start paying people back. Now, the reason the market is red is because the market is sitting here going, whoa, 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 let's get ahead of this. Let's sell before the rest of Mt. Gox people sells, right? It all of a sudden becomes a fire sale. So now that we know that the Mt. Gox payment is happening, what's the most important thing out there to tell us what's going to happen in the crypto market? The price of Bitcoin. Exactly, right? Because it's following Bitcoin. Now watch this. This is the Bitcoin chart up on the screen at the five minute. Compare it to XLM, XRP, it looks almost identical, right? You see this right here, right before the fifth when the pain train happened? Check it out. People are leaving the crypto market, right? Too much volatility, too much risk. Mt. Gox payments are happening. Here's the official letter right there. So people are leaving crypto and where are they going into? Safe haven assets. Check it out. Gold was going completely sideways. And then look at this. Look at this mark right here. Watch what happens. Bitcoin crashes at that time, gold goes up. XRP crashes at that time, gold goes up. XLM crashes, gold goes up. So there you have it, everyone. People jumping more and more into gold as a safe haven play, while the BTC and rest of the crypto market melt down because of fears of Mt. Gox payments. And the worst part is, the people that are finally getting their Bitcoin, Bitcoin Cash, and all that goodiness, they're not all going to sell. Some of them are going to hodl it. But the market right now is so scared that the market is trying to get ahead. And that's why you're seeing everything sell off now. Where guess what, everyone? It's not all selling off because they're moving to safe haven. So how am I going to play this? Well, I'm going to use Bitcoin as my indicator along with safe haven asset plays. If safe haven asset starts pulling back and Bitcoin looks a little bit better, we get some sustained momentum on that, well then guess what? We're in a better place. But the Mt. Gox payment is going to be happening for a while and people are seriously afraid that the majority of the people receiving payments are just going to dump on the market. So this is the market shitting itself ahead of actual Mt. Gox BTC flooding the market. That is how weak this entire thing is. Choo-choo, bitches. I mean, I guess the train has left the station. Excellent melting faces. I mean, I guess if you're outside in the sun and it's 105 degrees. But right now, you're seeing an extremely soft market with people fleeing to safe haven assets like gold.